What is going on guys, it's Waffle here and welcome back to some more Bridge Constructor Portal. Now, last time we left off, we finished level 46, the braid, and now we're going to move on to Bounce, 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 which I can only imagine we're going to have a lot of repulsion gel bouncing us and maybe even some cubes and stuff all over the place. So, ooh, we're going to have a word from GLaDOS today, and uh, it looks like we're going to have, ooh, yeah, okay, so we have Propulsion Gel, the gel that makes you go fast, and Repulsion Gel, the gel that makes you bounce, so that's cool. No cubes though, like I said, so uh, I guess we're not going to be bouncing alongside cube friends, but well, look at that, like, ha pretty much everything's covered in heckin' repulsion or propulsion gel. Except for the beginning here. <laughs> Jeez, and of course we have the danger of lasers too. Let's see what GLaDOS has to say. For health and hygienic protocol, please do not unravel any excess multi-purpose super cable. Okay, well, I could, I, just, I barely even use it anyways, whatever. <laughs> Anyways, let's see. Hmm, what are we doing here? So we start out the. Oh my god, another really long convoy. 15 in this convoy. So we're coming out of here. We're gonna, I guess, maybe bounce, bounce, bounce there. If we go through this portal, we come out of that portal. Probably bounce again. <laughs> and then. Ooh, if we do bounce, we probably wanna bounce off this, bounce on, off that, then eventually land up there. Avoid this laser over here. Hmm, I wonder how we're gonna do that. I don't think if anything, we do have propulsion gel here that's going to speed us out, and then even a little bit more right before we, or right after we come out of the portal. So might just need to make a small little ledge here, and then uh, speed us all the way to this, and that'll probably bounce us there, and then probably don't even need to build anything. Maybe just like a small little catcher platform or something. And we do have an anchor point up there we could use. So hmm, seems pretty simple enough here. Probably don't want to bounce here, honestly. Now that I think about it, probably want to have something there. Maybe put a. Uh, Thing here, there you go, that way it doesn't move. Yeah, it's not going anywhere. I don't know how... Uh, yeah, I can't extend that anymore. So if we come out of there, we want to be bouncing. And let me let me just do a test drive real quick. With one thing there... Are we going to make it to the other side? Uh, ooh, okay. Might want to make the road come out a little bit more. So maybe... Maybe, uh, maybe not that much. Maybe about to there, yeah. Let's see. Is that good enough? Is that going to make us bounce all the way over to the... Other platform... Ooh, not really. Hold on. Actually, what what would happen if I angle that down a little bit? Where hopefully we hit the thing and bounce a little bit more head on. Is that going to help? Nah, that's not going to help. I don't have an anchor point here where... Uh, I guess if anything, I could do this. Where I could use an excess of that multi-purpose tethers. <laughs> like Gilato said not to do. But, uh, there you go. Get rid of that. I could do this. There you go. Maybe make that... Maybe about like that-ish, something like that, maybe. Is that is that good enough? I don't know if that's good enough for... Oh, oh, whoops, I didn't connect that. Whoops, there you go. I don't know if that's good. Oh, it's slipping off now. Is that... That might... Mm, it might... It might... Mm, I don't think it's going to work. Uh, I don't think we hit it, but that thing's basically gone now. Yep, it fell off. Oh! <laughs> I can crash into that cheese. Ooh, uh, now that I think about it, we might be able to... Well, we're gonna do this. We're gonna be coming out like that. We might be able to hang something down there, too. And speaking of hanging, we're gonna be probably using some su suspension supports or something there. Or, you know what, we might as well use one of those diamond things that I've been using lately. There you go. Uh, oh, whoops. C can't even connect anything. There you go. Uh, got it! And of course, I'm still accidentally deleting roads. Sheesh. Anyways, there you go. Oh, I can't connect that? Oh, there you go. I uh, might as well, uh, there you go. Make that come out a little bit too. There we go. I don't know if I can connect that. I can connect that though. Hmm, seems pretty strong. Which means I can also make a little suspension thing to maybe hang a little catcher platform or something here. If it can even hang there. I don't know if it can. I guess we'll find out, but uh, we could do that. Is that gonna, uh, it's not really moving that much. Hopefully it'll stay there. But uh, is there anything else? I think we might be fine. Yeah, I think we might be fine. And then we could do that. And just to make sure it doesn't, move too much we could do that and uh, that's not really going to help yeah i don't really don't think i need to worry about that but we do have some suspensions here uh oh i guess we could i can't do that though i can't connect it to there either hmm oh whoops i guess if anything i could do that uh, i really just don't want that moving too much you know but at the same time there you go is that good i don't know let, let's let's see how's that one hold up hopefully it holds up pretty well i can probably fix this problem by oh there we go we bounce and then Ooh, ooh, yeah, I should probably, uh, make this ramp up a little bit, you know? Is that, is that going to be good? Uh, we might be fine. Of course, I can still connect that. That's good. I like that. But, I don't know about this little bit down here that's kind of sticking out. I'm like, if anything, I could maybe make them ramp upwards. Is that maybe going to help out? 
Oh, something just got to... Oh, yeah, that thing over there. Whoops. Uh, oh! Oh, okay, that, that did it. But, of course, we're not getting that much speed now. But we still hit the bounce. Ah. Okay, so... Looks like that helped a bit. We don't want it to go that far, though, so let's, let's bring that inwards a little bit more. The thing over there got destroyed. I need to get rid of it, though. <laughs> there we go. And... Yeah, they're not getting much of that uh, propulsion gel. And that didn't really help with that much. Oh! Ooh, yeah, okay. Yeah, I, I should probably pull that in as much as I can, honestly. Get rid of this, because that's just going to get deleted. Sheesh. <laughs> and let's see. That's going to make him ramp up a little bit. And... Ba-boom. And... The thing is, they flip there, and then they miss, like, half the propulsion gel. Oh, that's a really good run there. I like that. We might not even need to build anything over here. Ooh, uh, yeah. Like I said earlier, yeah, we might need to build, like, a little platform here to catch it. And then, of course, something here up top. Something up here to hold the bridge. And maybe, just like I said, do a little triangle meme. There we go. Whoops. There we go. Maybe even make it come out to there. Just a little bit extra support some stuff. There we go. That might be, that might be fine, you guys. I think we might be good. Okay, let, let's test that out. Is that good enough? This ramp up here, that seems to have fixed most of our problems, although we still do bounce and roll and miss a little bit of the propulsion gel, but still get a pretty good amount of it to where we bounce, and I think we might be fine here, you guys. If anything, we might want to worry about the strength of this. No, never mind. We got it! Yeah! Look at that! But is he going to be able to hold up against 15 of these fellas going through on the convoy? This bit right here isn't even moving. This ramp over here isn't really the biggest deal in the universe. So I think we should be able to speed past that. If anything, the only thing we need to worry about is this up here. Making sure that doesn't collapse. Look at this, though. Zooming out a bit. Watching everyone go. Like a bunch of lemmings. Ooh, yeah, the bridge up top. Watch that. A lot of it's turning red. But it seems like it recovers just in time for the next forklift. I think we got it, you guys. I think we've got this no problem. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, never mind. I said that too early, man. Hmm, I feel like maybe, how could we distribute this a little bit better? Maybe, I don't know, do something like that. Then, I uh, can't do any more. Man, ah, man. Let me try and center all these things, make everything a little bit more efficient. But there we go. But I believe that should get the job done pretty well. If anything, I could add a tether straight to each and every one of these. Nah, I can't do it. Nah, I can only add a tether to that one down there. Okay, whatever. Let's do it with the convoy again. So, I think like maybe two-thirds of it made it through, no problem. Let's watch this add a zoomed out view here. If you guys are watching on like an iPhone or something, might be a little bit too hard to watch, but you'll be able to see little ants moving across the screen or something. But let's see. Is that gonna still hold up there, that bridge at the top? Seems a lot stronger than before, honestly. I think we fixed a lot of the problems. Centering those triangles and stuff, you know? If anything that tether might give out. Mmm, so far so good. It is kinda jiggly. Might wanna add some more supports on the bottom, if anything. Oh my god, whoa, hold on. Ooh, that bridge eventually gave out over there. Ooh, hold on. So let me see. I think I might have a solution like already without even looking at this because I could see. Might want to make this parallel with that one down there. So let's see. What about that? Is that good? Just trying to center all the vortices or vertexes or whatever it is of the triangles with these. And of course, I could add even more stability by connecting this all the way over to here like so. Oh, uh, whoops. Can't do that. Oh, can I make that come out a little bit more? Yes, I can. And I can do this. There you go. Just add a little little bit more stability, hopefully, but there we go. That's, that's pretty good, I think. And then we can add some tethers, classic, there we go. Just some classic tethers, just to make sure that it doesn't jiggle too much to where it eventually heck can explode. But there we go, I think, I think we got it here, you guys. Whoops. Uh, yeah, I, I guess I'll get it done. That seems pretty stable there. GLaDOS did say to not use excessive, uh, multi-purpose tethers, but <laughs> what are you gonna do, right? Anyways, I think, I think we might... Oh my god, that's not even moving anymore. Wow, yeah, we, we definitely fixed that pretty well. If anything, now all we have to worry about is this top bridge up here, which, I'm like, we fixed that a little bit ago. It's not even really turning red. Seems to be holding up pretty well, which is awesome, so... Let's just keep watching. That bridge on the right is still holding up flawlessly. Oh, whoa, something's happening up there, though. Oh, they eventually start crashing into each other. No! Hold on. There is a domino effect. What happens? What happens? What is the first straw to br eventually break the camel's back? Let me see. If anything, I could always fix that first ramp to where they 
get more propulsion gel. But let me watch this upper bit up here to see when they eventually start crashing into each other. Ooh, ooh. That one, just one of them just, they just start randomly. I think, I think maybe they start. Yeah, okay, let's, let's adjust this a little bit here at the end. Hopefully get rid of any, let me just do a singular car drive. See if they'll still make it and hopefully not roll on that. Ooh. Oh, that's a lot. Yeah, mm-hmm. I like that. Yeah, lots of belts and... And ooh, that might have fixed it, you guys. I think I think we might have gotten it there. Hold on, yeah, let's get back to build mode. Might want to add a little bit of extra stability and support and whatever else. Uh, I want to make this connected to that down there, but I guess I can't past a certain point. I guess I have to have it like that, but there we go. Connect it like that, and then like this. Hopefully that'll keep it up a little bit, but it does add a little bit of weight, so we do need to watch out for that. Let's try and uh, do maybe something like that, and I think we might be fine here, you guys. Okay, let, let's do the convoy now. Let's zoom out. Let's get a full picture view of everything that's going to be going on, all the mountain and stuff, and let's see if any problems arise. You can see they're on the bottom right. They're definitely getting way more of that propulsion gel, getting a lot more speed. This seems to be... Oh my god, yeah. Everything... Oh, whoa! Okay, I thought something went wrong right there. <laughs> I think we're still fine everywhere, you guys. That top bridge... Ooh, slowly turning a little bit red. Mmm! So far, so good. No one's crashing into each other. No bridge is given out. And I think we solved it! Ooh, ooh, yeah! Let's... Oh my god! The bridge gives... Oh my god. If the convoy was 16 instead of 15, I don't think we would have made that, you guys. <laughs> that is so... That was, like, perfect. It started breaking there at the very end. Let's, let's watch that again. I really want to see. When does that break with the last car? I want to see just how closely we made it past the convoy of this level. Could we have possibly made it with 16 cars? Let's see. Okay, I think we're slow. Okay, there's the last car. And... I think we could have maybe made... Yeah, I think we could have made it with 16. Mm -hmm. it's, it, 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 if anything, we could repair that and you know make it a little bit stronger, and we could have held that through like a billion convoy or something like that. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not bragging, but I'm pretty sure we could do that. Anyways, let's move on to the next level. I'm slowly getting better at this game. Like, uh, like I feel that I'm not really having like a bunch of trouble with this. Like, where I have to spend like 20 billion years trying to figure something out. Either that, or the levels are getting a little bit easier. I don't know. Probably a little bit of both, right? <laughs> Anyways, the convoy. And this is only 10, so that's good. We don't have another billion convoy. So we're going to have pellets on this level. We have to get the pellets into our pellet home. We're going to be running over buttons with our forklift. We're going to be getting uh, cubes on buttons. Uh, I guess we're going to get confused by a bunch of portals. <laughs> uh, we have the paddle, we have the cubes getting dispensed, danger of falling to sewage, lasers, and we have the danger of getting hit by a pellet. Okay, so kind of a little bit of mix of everything right here. A lot of portals, we have the springs. I don't even think it did it even show a little. It didn't even show a little uh, thing for, for springs, but we do have a spring there. Uh, I don't know if we're going to be using that or if the cube is. I think that maybe the cube, I don't know. It's hard to tell, but let's try and figure everything out right now. So we're going to be coming out of there, probably going through either the blue or... Mm, actually, yeah, what in the world? So we're going to go through the blue. We're going to be coming out of here and then either to the red or the teal. If we go to the teal, we activate that button, which dispenses that cube. But if we go through the red, that means we fall down into the green, fall up into the purple, and then to the end. Okay, so the, the red is definitely our ticket out. Don't want to do the red just yet, but I think I know... Mm, wait, hold on. Do we have the thing where we cross paths? No, we don't have a thing saying we might cross paths, but we might still do that. I'm thinking we might want to go here, go through the blue, come out of that, go up, ramp up to the teal, come out of the teal, and then go down to the red, and then hopefully enough time passes where the cubes and stuff kind of get their job done and everything where oh wait what in the world okay so we don't even have to worry about the pellet like bouncing it it's just going to go immediately into its home <laughs> okay and then whenever the pellet goes into its home it's going to activate the laser and huh and i think cubes can go through lasers i think they can and then so uh, what's going on here do i want to distract the pellet here and make sure it never hits that by possibly doing something like this or maybe making a straight one like that where <laughs> the pellet never heck can go to the can I, can I connect these two yes I can there you go where the pellet never 
goes to its little home or something like that. Where it just bounces back and forth. Something like that. I feel like maybe something like that. But then here, maybe I'm going to knock that cube out of the way with this cube. And then we don't have to worry about those. What, what, what is this one called again? Control center. Ooh, very interesting. Yeah. Oh, wait, hold on a second. Ooh, I think we have a decoy here. There's a fake news one. Or it is, it's real, but we don't want to actually have the pellet go into there. But we do want the pellet to go into that home because that's going to open up the little thing at the very end. So that means doing something relatively simple, making two 45 degree angle things. Uh, God, I'm going all over the place here. <laughs> So that's going to come out there. Probably want to want to bounce it there and then make it go down and then bounce it again. Maybe where's this at? The end is about right there. Yeah, maybe about right here ish. Yeah, so we're going to want it to bounce in those two different places. Eh, about right there, you know. So that means making a 45 degree angle like this. Uh, move it down just a little bit. I think that's a 45. I can't tell. But then uh, also connect that. Oh, whoops. Oh, thankfully we have the I just made a heck of a mistake button. <laughs> there you go. And then do the same thing here. For, I think this, uh, it's hard to tell with all these lines. I think that's 45 degrees. Seems like it. Okay. But uh, yeah, that looks like it. Okay. And then we'll connect these just so everything doesn't heck and move. Turn this into uh, that. That seems like it might be fine. Let's see what, yeah, let's see if that actually works. Ooh, whoops. That's bouncing a little bit too high, so let's move that down. Ooh, let's move that like that, and then move that upwards. I think, oh yeah, that looks, that looks pretty parallel. Is that good? I think we've got it, you guys. Oh, that might be a little too high. Ooh, yeah, that's a little bit too high, okay. So let's move that down just a little bit. All right, that, ooh, I can't do that though. Hmm, I can do this, and that means that, and then there, is that? That might, ooh, that might get the job done. I think we've got it. Yep, and then the last bit opens, no problemo. All right, but we also need to watch out to make sure we don't have to, let me, let me, let me see, I might be able to make this a lot shorter. Yeah, there's a lot of like ledge and stuff here we don't need, so let's try and pull that in. I really want to keep that like that ish. <laughs> Just so we don't use too much of that and we don't run into it whenever we come back through. But I think we've got it there. Let's go to go into his home. Yep. And what about here on this first bit? Yep, we've got a lot extra we can get rid of. So I think we can do that and we can get away with that. Boom, boom. And that's not going to get in the way of the green portal. I think we're good. All right. So we're going to need to slide this cube all the way down to that ring. Yes. Yes, we are. OK, so let's uh, build a little slide here. That's going to slide it all the way down. At least it shows the trajectory of the cube so we know where it's going and where we can build in terms of the slide and whatnot. Right. So there you go. We're good. And just kind of do some regular triangles here and just make sure we connect everything together. That seems good. And uh, we could always use some tethers. But honestly, I think I can get away with this all just being tethers just because I'm like it's, oh, whoops, what I just do right there? Too bad I don't have a redo button. I just have an undo button. <laughs> but I think I can get away with this all being tethers just because it's a cube. It's not going to be heavy and all that kind of stuff. Oh, whoops, I just connect that directly to a heckin' thing. But there we go. Oh, whoa. Oh, I didn't build anything down there. Uh oh, well, they hit the heckin' laser. Whoops. But yeah, I think I think that should be fine. I think that should be fine. And then maybe just there you go. Try and directly connect everything together. Eh, I think that should be fine. Yep. All right. So what did we say earlier? So go through the blue, go through the deal and then come out of the teal and then back to the red. I think I said something like that. So how are we going to do that? So it's just going to be a simple bridge all the way to the other side that. And then, of course, we're going to need to make it slope down just a little bit. So there we go. And there we go. Let's do some classic triangles. There we go. That seems like it's going to be really good. Nice strong. Turn those all into roots. There we go. See that, uh, ooh, didn't even connect that. Whoops. I guess I can't. What in the world? Whatever. There we go. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Because that's kind of curving down and stuff, I definitely want to have these. I guess if anything, we could do some triangles at the top to make sure it doesn't heck an accordion in on itself, you know? <laughs> but there you go. Let's see. How's that going to go? That might be fine. That might, mmm. It's, it's going to be kind of close, though. I really don't want it heck and Killing itself. Ah, uh, that might be good. 
That might, that might get the job done. Okay. And then we're going to come out there and then just kind of build a ramp upwards to the teal portal. And then, of course, we're going to need to have a ramp up and then a ramp down. This one's going to ramp downwards and like that. And it's going to need to heck and catch it about right there-ish. There you go. There's a little road. This might get the job done. I don't think that trajectory is quite good. I want to just have that one come out like that. Yeah, we, we might be fine with that. Yeah. And then I guess we could just kind of do something like this and then just kind of add some supports here at the bottom to make sure it doesn't heck and go anywhere. There we go. I think I think we're fine on that front, you guys. All right. Might want to... Uh, I might be able to connect these. Ooh, there we go. That, that adds a little bit of stability, so that's good. And can't move that upwards anymore. Yeah, I don't want to move that upwards anymore than I already have it. So let's do a test drive now. Let's see where everyone goes. Hopefully everyone goes where I need them to go. So that's going to need to go up to the chill. Ooh, we need to make that slant down a little bit more. So there we go. Let's test drive again. <laughs> Attempt number two. And there we go. Successful. We're going to hit that button. And that other cube should... Wait, what happened to the other cube? Did the other- what- what happened to the other cube? The other cube should have gotten dispensed, did it not? Did they hit the button? I'm pretty sure they did. Hold on, uh, let, let, me, let me see. Whenever he goes through this, did he actually skip the button? He might have. He did! Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna need to make that flatten out a little bit just to make sure he doesn't hack and uh, then there we go. Hopefully we can still hit that. Can we still hit that? Uh, hopefully we can. Let's see. But he skipped over the button. That that cube's supposed to fall down and then hit that cube out of the way so it gets rid of that laser. So let's see. Oh my god, yep. Oh wait, no, he hit that that time. No! Man, I need to, I need to slow him down a bit here, you guys. Hmm. I guess if anything. Maybe we can just get rid of that altogether. So we don't heck can do that. And maybe he'll flip and maybe take a little bit of extra time or something. I don't know. <laughs> Let's see. He hits the button. The cube comes down. No, he's coming out. He's still coming out. No, man. Come on. I could ramp him up a little bit, too. <laughs> Let's see. I really need to slow him down a bit because the cube needs to come down and knock that other cube out of the way. So. Let's see. There he goes. Okay, okay. Okay, that slowed him down. Oh my god, that completely- Oh my god, that missed. <laughs> that missed the heckin' thing! Uh, let me do one of these, just kinda heckin' force it. There we go, and that's good. That's some good eatings right there. There we go, that should force it. <laughs> That looks awful. That looks terrible. There we go. All right. Uh, that should be good. All right, you guys. Let's do a test drive now. Man, hopefully that fucking cube goes there now. Okay. Let's get a zoomed out view. Now, we do have this guy just kind of crashing into the thing. Of course, that's bad. I don't want to make the bridge actually explode. But, uh... There you go. Knock that cube out of the way. That's what we wanted. And then... Ba-boom. And... Ba boom! All we need to do now is build a bridge at the end. Nice! I think we've got it, you guys. Let's make this about like that ish. Try to make these about equal ish. Try to move these to be about the same. Make this a little bit smaller. I think they're all about the same size. That's really good. Okay, that's good. Probably don't even need that. To, uh, yeah, okay. I'll, I'll, I'll still use that. Yeah. Let's make these all in the middle. About like that. That's good. We could probably use that for tethers or something. Or uh, I don't know. I could do that. Hmm. Seems like it might be stable. So let's. Turn that into a road. I think we're good, you guys. I think we've got this. I don't know if it's good enough for a peckin... Was that 10-car convoy? I don't know if it's good enough for a 10-car convoy. Ooh, crashes into that. That's good. That's gonna knock the cube out of the way. Yeah! And then he falls through that. Goes through that portal. Comes out of this portal at the end. Hmm, decently... Ooh, ooh. I know what I need to do here at the very end. Probably need to extend that out a little bit more like that. There we go. I th I th that should be fine. That should be fine. <laughs> oh, you never know, though. Hopefully it holds up. Let's do a, let's do a test drive with just, with just one car this time. Of course, this map is basically set up to where if the first car can make it through, all the rest can make it through. So, there we go. That cube's going to fall down. Knock the other cube out of the way. And... Ba-boom! Yep! And then we're going to fall through this portal. Yep. And then go up through that portal and come out of this portal. Hopefully the bridge is fine. Yeah! Let's do the convoy now, you guys. Hopefully we can do the convoy. Ooh, they're coming out rather fast. Hopefully they don't crash. Yeah, definitely don't want to crash here in the middle. Especially when we're gonna do that. Ooh. Mm, if anything, all we need to do is heck and just have this pile up just eventually. <laughs> just fix itself. There's like six of them stacked up on each other. Come on. All we need is this pilot, because they're just going to fall out of the sky. That's all they're going to do. 
As long as at least one makes it through, the rest should make it through, right? Oh, 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 they're falling. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh, no, man. Some of them are dying. Ah, oh, man. Okay, so it worked for the first car to slow them down by basically hitting this heckin' thing. But after that, they get heckin' stuck. And I should definitely add these things back. There we go. That way they have to go down. Yeah, okay. Because I did I did raise that to where he basically hits that, so now I might as well just add those ramps back to where they're gonna slope down and hopefully fall down into the red portal. One at a time, hopefully, you know? Sheesh. There we go. One there. Okay, they're slowly piling up down there now, but they're, they're making it through. Yeah, I don't think it really matters that much. As long as the, oh, so far haven't lost anyone. That's good. We have one guy stuck in the blue portal. You can't heck and get through for what? Oh my god! Whoa! Wait! Whoa! 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 What? Two of them got destroyed. What happened here? I think this cube got destroyed. So that means we might want to make maybe something like that. And then have that like that. And then something like this. So that way, if a cube does fall down, it doesn't get destroyed. Hopefully. <laughs> In theory, on paper. Let's see if this is going to help, though. I don't know if it will. Ah, oh, man. There we go. Ah, oh, man. I don't know. Hmm. That's curving down a lot. That's going to... Ooh, wait. Hold on. That... That's still going to go in there, right? Yep. Okay, okay, I think I think we should still be fine. Okay, let's do the convoy now. Hopefully we can do it. <laughs> we did lose two of them. So, mm, let's see, let's look at the big picture here, you guys. Hopefully we can get the convoy through. And the cube is going to hit the other cube out of the way here in a second. There we go. Oh, the other cube fell down. You guys see that? The cube fell down. It's fallen out. Huh. I don't know what we could do there other than maybe do something with this where if it does fall, like get rid of that and then there you go, it'll, 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 it'll get caught or something, but still have enough room there for the other guys to come through. I don't know. Oh man, I, I, the thing is, I don't want to add too much weight and all that kind of stuff and make this thing. Ooh, yeah, like that. Now that's in a heckin' way. Don't need that to be like that though. Mm, that might be fine. Ooh, is that gonna go in there? Yes, it is. Okay, okay, okay. I think we might be good. Okay, let's try it now with the convoy. The pellet makes it through, no problem. That should hopefully catch the cube and make sure it doesn't go flying all over the place and cause the other cube to get heckin' dispensed again. Oh, uh, everything seems to be fine. Okay, the other cube is falling. No, that didn't work. Oh, I think I might have a... Hmm, nope. Yeah, I can't make that go up anymore, though. Man. Let me watch it again with a singular car. A singular forklift. That cube is really our biggest problem right now. There we go. And it got caught. Oh, no, it fell again, man. All right, guys, I think I got the solution. Sheesh. So I pulled this down a little bit more to where now I can connect that to that. Pulled this in by one more. It went to there. Now it's into here. Uh, eventually, everyone started crashing into that and everything just went to heck after that. <laughs> Past that, I think I think everything should be fine. Everything seems to be running like a well-oiled machine. I haven't done the convoy fully through yet. Well, let's see if everything works fine. They hit the button now. Cube got dispensed. Cube's going to go flying. Hopefully the- Oh my god, that was so close! Did you guys see that? The cube knocked the other cube off like a millisecond before the for first forklift hit the- what would have been the laser before it turned off. Any problems over here? Everyone getting stuck. Oh! Oh! Yes! Oh my god! Yes! Oh jeez, finally this level's done. Jeez! <laughs> Let's go on to the next level. Level 49. Wow. Turretville. Oh my god. Now we have a bunch of heckin' turrets we have to worry about. We haven't had turrets for a while. Now this convoy is going to be six forklifts long, so we need to watch out for that. Of course, here on Turretville, we have the danger of getting heckin' shot by a turret. We need to run over buttons. We need to hit buttons with cubes. We have the danger of falling to sewage, and we need to knock turrets off their pedestals. We're going to get confused by a million heckin' portals. We're going to be dispensing cubes, and of course, at the end, there's probably going to be a paddle in the way, like usual. I feel like this is going to be one of those levels where it looks complicated, 
complicated at first, but eventually we kind of figure everything out. Just kind of process of elimination and figuring out which ones are decoys and all that kind of stuff. Yep, here at the very end, we have a battle. So let's figure everything out by starting out here. So it seems like we're going to be coming out, going through the teal portal first, which means going through here and probably hitting the teal guy with our forklift and then hitting that button, which will activate the cubed fallout. And then he'll destroy the other turret. Actually, he'll destroy this turret. He'll fall down and probably hit this turret as well. Oh, and then he'll fall down and hit this turret too. And I think all the turrets should be gone by then, huh? <laughs> but then on the other end of things, the forklift will continue going through this, through the blue portal, I guess indigo or purple portal, through that, through the green, green goes here, I guess green is going to go through the purple, purple goes through there, oh wait, no, 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 oh, hold on, so I think, I think the yellow and the red are, are decoys, yep, so up here, we're going to have to forget about that, yellow goes to red, red goes to yellow, all that kind of stuff, going to have to ignore that, because that's just a big old heckin' distraction, so I want to just build a regular old bridge from this, all the way to the other side, just a straight path all the way like so. All right. And then do some classic triangles here in the middle and then connect that very nicely. There we go. Probably don't even need to use that bottom anchor point down there. I might be fine already. Although maybe with higher traffic, we might need to worry about it, but mm, that's holding up. Eh, that's, yeah, let's just use it just because why not, right? Mm, can't use that. Ooh, can't do it. That's holding it up. I eh, can't complain. That, that seems to be getting the job done pretty well. And then over here, of course, we're going to be running into this. So we're going to want to do 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 do. I think we might be fine on that front. There we go. There we go. And then connect those and ba-boom. There we go. Maybe do that just because why not? And then we'll have to do the same thing over here, basically. And I guess if anything, we could kind of do this. Now we can actually build across that. That seems good. There we go. And can't build upwards any. So that's kind of unfortunate. Might want to use tethers for this just because why not, right? Jeez. <laughs> and there we go. I don't, need, I don't think I need tethers on the other end. I, th I think we might be fine. I mean, this doesn't even connect to anything. Might as well connect it if I can, right? Ah, I can't connect it to anything. Man, whatever. There you go. Those are connected now. So there you go. Uh, whoops, I just did something. I uh, just turned something into a road. But up here, yep, let's just build a straight path all the way to the other side. Let's start by building the road. There we go. Might want to have that slowly ramp upwards. There we go. And let's see how everything here holds out. Uh, I think we might be fine. But then again, we're going to need to get the... Uh, oh, yeah, we still have this end bit over here we need to start building so we need to get this cube to fall all the way down and hit this so it opens up this little paddle right here to the very end so hmm i think i think this purple i think that purple is going to be a decoy yeah that, that seems like it's going to be a decoy yeah so don't want to worry about building stuff there although we do want to probably use these right here for stuff so let's start building some stuff with it trying to usually get some anchor points there we go hey, it's complicated as heck i don't know what i'm doing sheesh <laughs> but we're going to be coming out of the green portal which means we're probably going to be flying out Ooh, Ooh, yeah, for f Ooh, yeah, we do. I yeah, okay. I think I think we do want to go to the purple portal then. Yeah, because we're going to be phasing to the left. So yeah, I guess we do have to use that. Yeah, the purple is not a decoy then. Yeah, although I do want to use these. I don't even know what I'm doing up here, by the way. <laughs> Just kind of making a design. <laughs> Just kind of amusing myself by making a weird, wacky design. But there you go. Just try and get something hopefully stable and strong. Basically lowering the anchor points. But uh, there we go. Might want to start getting those roads up. There we go. And then maybe angle that up a little bit. There we go. And then down here, we're going to want to have it kind of slope down like this. Something like that. So it can goes down there no matter what. There we go. I think I think that should be good. I think that should be good, you guys. <laughs> Although uh, this is very unfinished over here. Very unfinished. I basically just want to see where the car goes so we can kind of build from there, but seems like we're good on this top bit. There we go. Destroy the turret. Hit the button. Uh, cube get Oh, whoops. That goes a little bit too low. Whoops. I guess that should be... Yeah, that should be fine. Okay, let's try it now. Oh, it kind of goes down a little bit there. You guys see that? Okay, I don't know why I did that, but let's see if we can go through this time. Yes, we can! Wait! Ooh! I forgot about that turret, though. Yeah! How could we possibly get rid of that heckin' turret? I think I know what we're doing now. Okay, so the red and the yellow are not decoys. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> we do need to use the red and the yellow. It's just that we need to come out of the yellow, kill that turret, go through the red, then we go through the red and up to the blue, I think? Does that mean- Ooh! I think I- th Okay. I think I know what we're doing here. Okay, well, I, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of getting things, like, all over the heckin' place, but might as well use this to- I guess I can't build there or whatever. 
There we go, but let's slowly make that slope upwards to try and get that turret nice and chilled. There we go. Connect everything together. Probably make up for the slumping down a bit too. Yeah, things are starting to slump down. And then over here at the very end, we're going to want to build some roads. All right, guys, back. I think I have something here. Okay, okay. So we figured out that the blue or the, the yellow and the red are actually useful. So I actually built this. So this is what it's going to look like for now. God, I'm building things again. Anyways, we're going to be coming out of here, of course. We're going to be going down into the yellow coming out of the yellow over here hitting that turret going into the red and then we're going to be coming out of the red right there and going up into the teal coming out of the teal there hitting that turret hitting that button which activates the cube to come down and start falling and destroying all these guys got a little bumper right here so it makes sure it gets that last one uh after we get that and hit the button we go through the purple which goes through and goes through the green which comes out up here and then we eventually like run like right into this but now uh, worry about that a little bit later probably move that about right there ish i don't know if that's going to help <laughs> <laughs> it might, I don't know. And then uh, eventually the cube comes down here, hits the button, activate that, and uh, opens that paddle up. And that's definitely going to help us out because that's where we have to go. Anyways, let's do a test drive. I did a test drive just off camera just moments ago, and it seems to be pretty successful. I don't know if everything is going to be fine. Are we going through the red now? Jumping up there, doing pretty well. Coming out there, hitting that turret, activating the button. Cube coming out. We go through that straight away. Getting rid of those turrets. All those turrets. Oh! Wait, what in the world? That turret was, it was killed. Okay, whatever. <laughs> we worry about that a little bit later then. Let's see. Oh, what in the world? There's like a random, oh, it's not even connected to anything. What in the world? Oh, okay. <laughs> right, let's do another test drive. Let's see how this goes. All right, the cube is dispensed. Get rid of that turret. Get rid of that turret. Fall down, hit that turret. All the turrets are down. And our little guy got dispensed and he's dead, but hey, the cube hit the button and that thing's dispensed now. And our guy is dead. Whoops. But how, once we come out of here, that's the problem. That's what we need to worry about is like, where in the world do we go? Hmm. Oh my God, you guys, this is extremely disgusting and messy, but I think it might work. Sheesh, this is an absolute disgusting mess over here. Everything over here seems to be fine. <laughs> then over here, trying to make the cube hit each turret, trying to make it come down, hit the button, make sure these guys tumble down and actually go through the portals and everything and make sure everything doesn't heck and break too. I think we might have to- Oh! Oh my god. Is it- Oh! Yeah. Oh my god, almost a quarter million dollars down the heckin' drain. I really want to go see how other people did this one. It's probably way better than this. They could probably do it for half the money. Oh my god, but I've been, I've been over here probably off camera. Just memeing around for the million years. Oh my god. And because there's like basically no anchor points over here on this side, you have to kind of think outside the box to get everything to, you know, go where it needs to go and make sure it doesn't wiggle and make sure everything is stable and doesn't break. So, and I even had this little bit over here to make sure this doesn't swing left and right. And there's a bunch of stuff that went into making this thing somehow work. But man. I'm glad it's finally done. I think at the beginning of this level, I was I was bragging. I was saying, man, we're getting pretty good at this. Either we're getting pretty good or the game's getting easier. But man, they hit us right in the heckin' face reveal. Right whenever we hit this level. Right, right whenever I started bragging, too. Man, that's why you should never brag. But at least we got it done. Let's watch it from the beginning this time. Because I know a lot of, I'm probably going to cut out a lot of footage here. And you guys are going to miss it. But they're going down pretty smoothly. This bottom bit is pretty smooth down here. It, it, this still bounces here, but that doesn't seem to be a problem. Going across that without getting snagged. Going across that straight bridge, no problem. They get launched out there. Some of them just randomly tumble for whatever reason. But uh, at the end, everything still catches them. <laughs> These guys still make it. The cube hits the thing, opens up the paddle. They, they're, everyone's making it over here, which is good. And, yep. Look at that. Man, not the cleanest, not the cleanest, what you could call bridge. But he got the job done, and that's all that matters to me. So, I think I'm going to call it a heckin' day. <laughs> I'm going to end the episode right here. So, thank you guys all for being watching. watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below. And if you guys want more of these awesome videos, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Now to put my latest videos on YouTube homepage as soon as they come out so you do not miss an episode. But until then, thank you guys all for being watching. watching. And I'll see you guys here next time with the final level of a portal British constructor or British constructor portal. 
here on the Event Horizon chapter, where we're going to be doing a long way home. Ooh, I wonder what, it's probably going to be a pretty big map, honestly. I wonder what it's about, so I guess you're going to have to tune in next time to find out. So thank you guys all very much for watching, and I'll see you guys here next time with some more Bridge Constructor Portal. Oh, bye there.